हेलो फ्रेंड्स लेट्स डिस्कस फोर टेस्ट्स टू डिफ्रेंशिएट बिटवीन ऑब्स्ट्रक्टिव एंड रिस्ट्रिक्टिव लंग डिसीज द फर्स्ट इज एफ ई वी वन एफ बी सी रेशियो दिस इज द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट डायग्नोस्टिक टेस्ट और कार्डिनल टेस्ट टू डायग्नोज ऑब्स्ट्रक्टिव लंग डिसीज वेयर इट इज रिड्यूस्ड वाई इट इज नॉर्मल और इंक्रीज इन रिस्ट्रिक्टिव लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड दिस when forced vital capacity is performed in healthy person it is completed in 3 seconds amount of air which is exhaled at the end of 1 second when forced vital capacity is performed is called fev1 and this is 83% of forced vital capacity so ratio is 83% because in obstructive lung disease in chronic bronchitis or emphysema there are airway blockages expiration is slow prolonged and incomplete and we can see here especially fev1 fvc ratio is significantly reduced and this is diagnostic test second is different expiratory flow rates which we can easily measure by flow volume loop this is maximum flow rate during forced expiration so all the flow rate including peak expiratory flow rate is reduced in obstructive while again normal or increased in restrictive lung disease restrictive lung disease on the other hand is diagnosed mainly on the basis of decreased total lung capacity so total lung capacity is decreased because this disease or group of disease is because of problems or disorders affecting alveolar wall pleura or thoracic cage in which expansion is affected so with if expansion is affected obviously total lung capacity is going to be affected most and it is diagnostic test obstructive lung disease patient on the other hand they breathe on higher volumes and total lung capacity may be increased residual volume because in obstructive lung disease expiration is not complete forced expiration or maximum expiration is not complete residual volume is increased in restrictive lung disease because they are having less air to deal less air to deal and expiration is not having any problem so more fraction of it can be exhaled and obviously residual volume can be decreased so this group is diagnosed on the basis of reduced fev1 fvc ratio supported by these changes restrictive on the other hand diagnosed on the basis of decreased total lung capacity supported by these changes so very important pulmonary function test to differentiate and diagnose both group of pulmonary diseases thank you so much